You have a favorite? I know I do. Stick with me as I count down the top 10 most popular ham radio videos of 2023. Looking at the numbers for 2023, I published 102 videos and hosted 15 live streams last year. At a rate of about two a week, I can't believe I've kept up that aggressive production schedule. All that content adds up to over 1.6 million views with over 123 hours of watch time. That's pretty amazing and I always feel it's the viewers that I need to thank because I couldn't do it without you and I'm thankful for your continued support of this channel. I always feel like I have the best viewers as their comments are insightful and I'm not plagued with those sad hams that seem to uh, flock to every other channel. Uh, this quality level of viewer gives me the incentive to continue and I'm going to maintain that schedule of producing high quality videos at a rate of about twice a week. With that being said, let's look at the top 10 videos for the last year. One subject dominated this year, and I think we can all guess it was the window screen ground plane or the magic carpet. Uh, four of those videos made the top 10 list and accounted for over 15% of my viewer traffic. Those are some pretty big heavy hitters. But without further ado, here are the top 10 amateur radio videos of 2023. Starting off the list at number 10 is the magic carpet rides again. As I said, the magic carpet or ground screen network videos have been the runaway hit this year. Starting off the list at number 10 is this one where Dave, KZ9V, shows how you can use a couple of window screens to turn your 40 meter N-fed half wave antenna into an 80 meter quarter wave radiator. Number nine, the DigiRig digital interface. Digital operations were never my strong suit as I always found it putsy in the field. The DigiRig digital interface totally changed that and now I love adding FT8 and the other digital modes to my parks on the air activations. This video shows you how easy it can be for you to do the same. Number 8. Shark HF Stick Extenders I love my Shark HF sticks as a fast setup antenna. This is especially true in the winter months when I don't want to spend a lot of time tuning and adjusting the antenna. In this video, I show you how you can get two more bands out of your Shark sticks for just pennies. Number 7. The Res Ranger 80 Antenna 2023 must be the year of the vertical antenna. Wolf River released their Sporty 40, Chameleon announced the loaded vertical, and Res Antenna Systems released their Ranger 80, a super durable high quality alternative to the Wolf River Silver Bullet 1000. I demonstrate the Ranger 80 in this video. Number 6. Hamfest Finds well, people love gear haul videos, and I had a particularly good haul at the recent Fox Cities Amateur Radio Club Hamfest, where I found an awesome Yesu FT817 QRP transceiver setup. For top videos, let's not forget our Wisconsin Poda Campout Live video. Uh, last October, I did a walkthrough of our Ham Radio Parks on the Air Campout uh, with other hams at the Northern Highland American Legion State Forest. <laughs> this live stream uh, had over 2,900 views and 265 likes, definitely the hit for our live streams uh, this past year. Uh, the uh, 2024 Wisconsin Porta Campouts coming in October, but now let's continue with the countdown. Number five, my Parks on the Air antenna kit. I get so many questions on what I use out in the field for and transceiver, antenna, batteries, and accessories. This video breaks down what I currently take out in the field as my HF antenna kit. Number four, Faraday cloth, the new magic carpet. The window screen ground plane is such a success that some hams asked if Faraday cloth, a metallicized fabric used for electromagnetic protection, could be used as a ground network. The short answer is yes, and this video sh proves it. Number three, build a 10 meter band dipole antenna. Well, just a couple weeks ago, I released a video on a 10 meter J-pole antenna, but, it was, but that video was too new to be counted in this year's list. Last year's 10 meter antenna was a dipole that you could make for just a few bucks, and it checked in with over 25,000 views this past year. Number two, how to do FCC exposure calculations. 
Well, after two years of us easing into this, the date has finally come for amateur radio operators to do exposure calculations for their antenna transmission systems. The FCC rule change isn't onerous, but it sure raised a lot of questions. Well, this video shows you how you can easily do those calculations. And the number one video for 2023 is the window screen ground plane. This is the original Magic Carpet video, and it's the runaway best video this past year with over 117,000 views in its first 30 days and 160,000 total views for the year. This might not be a new concept, but it sure has revolutionized portable operations for fast vertical antenna setups. I've gotten some pretty amazing contacts using the window screen as a ground network, and I know other hams are using it with great success. So there you go, the top 10 amateur radio videos of 2023. Did your favorite make the list? Well, let me know what you think in the comments down below. You can also find a playlist of the top 10 videos in the video description or on my website at www.jpol-antenna.com. Not mentioned in the top 10 are my favorite Parks on the Air activation videos. For those, I decided to do a little bit of a montage of all the great scenery that appeared in those videos this last year. That video will be coming up next. Well, but here are some plans for the coming year. We're in the middle of season 11, and I have some really exciting antenna reviews that are coming out in the next few weeks. Dave and I will be uh, mobiling for the Minnesota and the Wisconsin CUSO parties this coming February and March, so you're gonna wanna stay tuned for that. And also, Dayton Hamvention is coming up in May, and I will be in attendance, so save that date. Along with that, you can also expect more Parks on the Air activation videos, product reviews, ham radio how-tos, and also our monthly live stream. And of course, the normal cast of the characters are going to appear, Dave, Joe, and Travis, for some wacky adventures. But I think the biggest addition this year is going to be more web-based content. I'm not one to put all of my eggs in one basket, so you're going to find more blog articles and written content over on my website at www.jpol-antenna.com. Is there a topic that you'd like to see? Well, let me know and I'll add it to the list. But that's it for 2023. Thanks for watching. Thank you for your support. And here's to a most excellent 2024.